My amazing Leos, welcome into a general weekly reading for you. I hope life has been treating you well, but either way, let's jump into the tarot and see what this upcoming week has in store for us. Alrighty, got the shuffling out of the way. What do we have for Leo for this upcoming week? Flopping out. The Nine of Wands being um, an energy that you're embodying at certain points, but I feel like uh, you know how to best at this point turn this in the reversal and feel more alive, feel less wounded and uh, less tired. Because uh, I feel like you're a busy soul, a busy bee, right? Um, the Two of Cups, the Six of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, and the Ten of Pentacles. You're connecting with people, places, situations, occurrences, and accomplishments like a boss. People want to get to know you, and this is because you're interesting, you're intriguing, and you're embracing the unknown very strategically, even when you don't think so. People will share things with you very randomly, and I wouldn't be surprised if this is no nothing new for you individually, uh, being drawn to this reading. If people feel a comfort about your energy, uh, there's a bold but a uh, chill kind of vibe about you, I want to say, and people are picking up on the fact that you are changing left and right. The way you want to express yourself through accessories, your clothing, maybe smell, uh, could be your work as well. Uh, maybe how you're decorating or thinking about changing up the decorations uh, in your home and getting bedding specifically. This is all speaking upon your creativity within that needs to come out and speak to the world, speak to you. Um, you're getting your voice out there throughout the week and people are saying, uh, I appreciate this. I appreciate you. I like the energy you're giving off. Uh, you help me because you have healing energy for a lot drawn to the reading. You're also going to be seeking out help in certain ways throughout the week that feels unexpected. Say you're looking up how to better your health, right? In one, if not multiple ways, you're looking up um, how to feel uh, more energetic in a less uh, unhealthy, uh, in a more healthy manner, right? Uh, reminds me of me switching over to green tea recently and leaving the caffeine behind for the most part. Um, everything in moderation as well as coming through. But you are receiving abundance, my friend. And when we say that here uh, in this community, it typically uh, right to our head when we think about finances, right? And I feel like you're very focused on money. But there are moments throughout the week where you're selectively focused on the right things otherwise, right? That person, that connection in the moment. Um, your work and not thinking about the money benefits of it in the moment um, or in general. I, I do feel like you're being complimented throughout the week you're being treasured and this is of true importance because you're a treasure right i really feel like you have a purpose and a destiny being drawn to this reading that's going to reward you and others uh tenfold all right and this needs to take a highlight at least at one if not several different points uh throughout this week now when it comes to your big leo heart People are noticing, people are remembering, uh, people want you to keep in touch with them more, but it doesn't really feel doable because of your busy schedule or because you just, uh, maybe because your spirituality, like myself, I said that really weird, uh, pushes you at times to keep to yourself more than maybe you should or want to, um, or just maybe you lo love your alone time. Um, but there's a lot that's coming through um, meaning wise when it comes to wh what and who you feel disconnected from at this time or at least partially disconnected uh, I feel like it at least has something to do with how you're changing um, and how you've been healing right it does feel like naturally given we got the nine of wands to begin your reading uh, there's different types of healing still taking place throughout this week even if you feel you've wrapped up the healing process it's very continuing in this world right along your path but the ten of pentacles why do you feel very rich in energy? Why do you feel very happy at certain points throughout the week? Because you've been going through the healing, because you're putting in the work, because you're being honest with yourself. When you reduce a bad habit in your life, not fully it feels like, but as I twitch, um, you start to uh, notice the effort and how that's paying off for you, okay? Notice that you are um, improving things left and right. I did hear before beginning your reading, day by day, step by step, watch your Leo world transform in a very continuing manner uh, in new and existing uh, new and existing ways as uh, I just struggled a bit. But I also feel like there are times throughout the week where spirit is saying, Put on your cologne, put on your perfume, smell good, wear your glasses, right? Uh, maybe you need to wear a necklace of importance for you. Uh, there's going to be little moments of synchronicities uh, that are uh, certain spirits 
favorite ways of uh, getting through to you. Uh, you got to remember that certain spirits don't like to speak through our mind or through your dreams. They like to show you a synchronicity and it starts to get the wheels churning in your mind or it reminds you of something of importance. Um, it really feels like you're going to feel things deeply. No surprise there. And the spirit saying, well, what is your intuition telling you? Uh, there are times where we look to tarot or other uh, uh, sources of clarity and confirmation and uh, information otherwise uh, too much. I'm not saying stop watching my readings and others uh, or pulling your own cards, but there are going to be a few significant points throughout the week where you're pushed uh, by spirit or several to just sit, right? Sit in your intuition and what you're feeling. Uh, don't overdo it, of course, and trust it. Okay, you're feeling things accurately. Uh, you're going to feel like you know better about what you went through in a stressful manner uh, when it came to that person, place, situation that really wasn't right for you in the end or in general. Um, and I do feel like this is going to be uh, assisting you in making a correct choice or two throughout this energy period. Um, it does feel like as well there's a royalty vibe that you're being given by certain spirits as they're showing a crown on my head and they're saying keep that damn crown on moving forward because you hold such significance in this world and you forget it way too often uh, people are gonna notice that you um, want more out of life right you want more out of life um, I'm being told to leave that card on the floor um, the eight of Pentacles again it feels like you're putting in the work I need to take a moment um, I need to take a moment. I need to, to rest, to heal. I need to recover. But then I want to get back to it. I feel motivated. I feel electrified, but I also feel different. Good, good. It's all about changing, about growing and adapting to the twists and turns of your Leo path. Uh, when people uh, get to know you unexpectedly, don't be surprised when it teaches them something about what they're going through or maybe what they went through uh, or maybe what they want out of life now. Uh, you are going to be uh, pushed to take a second and notice at certain points, um, okay, a cancer of importance um, or somebody with cancer in their chart. But what I was going to say, um, you're going to be pushed to take a second and realize that your needs and wants are definitely changing at this time and probably have been uh, re uh, rewinding uh, back just slightly. But let's keep pulling. We have the Four of Wands and the Knight of Pentacles. I do feel as if you're going to see um, evidence through music, okay, uh, that your life is falling into place again step by step, day by day. Um, I do feel like these two pairing together nicely. Um, it reminds me of uh, the fact that I do need to take things slowly at times and not to burn myself out to feel the ease and peace uh, flowing back into my world. You're going to calm somebody down. It feels like, again, is what Spirit's saying. Um, and this is important because no one else can do it in the way you do it. Ugh, people need to relax. Um, I do also feel like you're noticing people in the right light. Does that make sense? Whether it's, um, okay, a disgusting light. <laughs> Interesting. There are gross people in the world, but uh, whether it's uh, they're in a, a good light, a bad light, and those of which that switch that up. Ugh, I can't stand that. It's like, you're either good or you're bad. Stop being fake, right? And I get that we all have our uh, good days and bad days and in-betweens, but um, it just feels like, again, you're seeing people in the right light. Speak it into existence, my friend. It's another week where um, I almost started your reading by saying, hello, my uh, manifesting Leos. Um, you're able to say something, and it, if it takes more time for it to come uh, into fruition for you, so be it. But it feels like you can speak it, and it comes to be, uh, regardless of when that ends up happening for you. Now, you're going to feel uh, very protected, all right? You're going to feel like protecting um, certain aspects of your Leo world. This is good. This is uh, a healthy thing. You're going to feel like resting at certain points when you don't want to because you need to rest. Um, you're going to as well be pushed to think about your voice, whether it's the importance of it, uh, the actual sound of your voice, um, and maybe how you've utilized it and how you haven't. Um, somebody needs to just create that social media account and uh, start talking or just start creating, right? Um, you'll uh, thank yourself in the end and along the way. The Three of Pentacles. Healthy attention is what I just heard. Healthy attention um, as I shake a little bit. But I, I feel like that was a message in and of itself. Also, temperatures taking a highlight. When you're heating up, uh, regardless of why that is, cool yourself down, right? Take it easy. When you feel cold, for some, John's to the reading, 
gain some heat somehow um, and you know how to do this you're a smart cookie um good job leo good freaking job i want to wrap up this reading by saying you're doing an amazing job balancing things out and choosing and changing the game for yourself 